guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later. Hold on, hold on, they're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. I mean, if they were trying to hit me, I would be dead. Deke, remember me telling you about that death wish of yours? Yeah, 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 I got this. Deke it out.
Why you like that, freak? Huh? Okay, it's a radio, all right. Man, I can always use this. Yeah. God damn it, get back here with that! Holy shit, that's mine! Looks like they were out here, shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt in some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? <laughs> what do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No! No, it's not... I, I, I don't know. I'm just... And he's alive, Boozer. He's alive. O'Brien. One of them. Nero. I'm gonna track him down. If I can, I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. <sighs> You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? Hey. Hey. So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh. That is just perfect. <laughs> that is great. That is great. So about those directions? I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Belknap? Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey!
Could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't know. How do I, uh, this contraption? Pretty much what you think. You just throw your I just... leg over. Yeah. Okay. Um, there. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I knew what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry, um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. Hey, you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um... I don't know, some... I don't know where I Road am. 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so... <laughs> okay, all right. <clears throat> all right, I just... It'll be any minute now. All right, so. all right, all right, screw it. Let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> you weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. You're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so... Here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. What the hell? Clean! We got company! Oh, shit. All right, gentlemen. Hit him again. Now you like that bike, boy. Way to do it. Come on, hit him. Not so tough now. Hit him. <laughs> oh, you don't learn, do you, bike boy? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I'll teach him. I'll teach him good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Oh, shit. Say, I'm out. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Roll, goddammit. Roll. 
Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, oh, my God. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, I, no, no. I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag, and no, it's I, I right. saw that, and I... Oh. oh, my God, I could have killed somebody. Well... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw gone. it in They're your gone. bag, and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're, no gonna we're gonna There's do? There's no reception. I'm gonna wait right here until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Full of squatters. You're the assholes who tried to ambush me. Murdering assholes can't let any of them get out of here alive. He shot me! Okay. Okay. One down. How many of you are left, huh?
Killing drifters, is that it? How do you like it now? Almost out.
Camp's clear. Now you know how it feels, being on the other end of it, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, we look like the type to have an underground bunker, yeah? Tucker. Hot Springs Camp, you there? I'm gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait. He mentioned Hungry Jim's. That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack. Big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know the one. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. I'll keep that in mind. Deacon out. This is 
Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's the Wild West again. And some men are acting like law and order are a thing of the past. But last I checked, this is still the United States of America. And in America, the right of property shall not be infringed. We have the right to claim territory, to hold it, and to defend it. Sure, we took this land from the Indians. No point in rewriting history. But we took it by force. And force is the only thing that will move us now. We're not gonna roll over for a bunch of bullies. If the feds, or rippers, or marauders think they're gonna come rolling into my wilderness, they got another thing coming. The strongest survive. The strongest take. And the strongest will succeed. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. That's something Cope Law and Order are a thing of the past. What the hell are you talking about? But yeah, you got a point about force being the only thing that matters now. Force and a lot of goddamn ammo. Bounty. Damn it. 